uh, I would see myself as Irish, but then again, I always did. But uh, I had to kind of figure out when I was in my 20s, figure out of, you know, it, it's not quite the same as Irish if you grew up in the same town and, and you die in that town and you know everybody in that town. I'm 90% Irish, but I probably have a few Brit bits as well, but that's okay. I have a penchant for stationery and I'll probably queue instinctively and um, I'll pay my taxes or I'll worry if I don't pay my taxes, which is not, necessar not necessarily <laughs> Irish traits. That my mother kind of almost as a symbol of Ireland uh, was closed and guarded and she never told us why she went to live in uh, England, what the circumstances were and re like I mean the, uh, there's a lot in the book where I'm just basically speculating as to why she went to England because she never told us. And, and you see, you kind of have to, and again, this is, this is it, it, to a degree how the contradiction bit is useful, because you have to leave gaps and all that. It can't all make sense. Being Irish doesn't make sense, really.